Hi there, my name is Andigo. Welcome to my channel. Can you believe 2018 is almost over? Uh, I think this has been the single year of my life that's felt the shortest? Now, before the year ends, I'm planning to do a proper uh, look back at 2018 with everything I've done, everywhere I've traveled, and, you know, have a little bit of a nice reflection on the year that's been. However, today, I thought, let's take a look at some of the videos that I made on the channel this year. Just in terms of sheer numbers, this has been the most productive year I've ever had on YouTube. I must have made, like, 200 videos or more this year, which is kind of crazy, considering a lot of them is music videos and original songs and stuff like that. And now, of course, you've seen the title already so today let's take a look at my 10 favorite videos that i made this year my 10 best videos uh in my own opinion these are not necessarily the videos that i made that got the most views or anything like that these are just the 10 videos that i feel the most proud of i guess also they're not really in any particular order whatever <laughs> ah First video on the list is gonna be Dan TDM Remix The Musical, uh, which is a original song and music video, musical kind of thing that I released all the way back in May. And contrary to the title, it's not actually a Dan TDM Remix. God, this intro with Maya. Once I was full <laughs> of ideas. Just a boy with endless dreams. This is basically a Broadway musical kind of thing uh, I did back in May uh, when I was in Japan and we had YouTube space, the, the big green screen studio available for a day, and I wanted to make something fun. And I had this idea to make a musical uh, based on the fact that I have to make Dan TDM remixes for the channel, because that's kind of a meme. So I basically made this. I have to make a <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I was so scared when I was gonna make this video, like, what are people gonna say? Are, are they not gonna get the joke? But people liked it, and Dan TDM even reacted to it himself, and he really liked it, so that was really fun. Also, look at Maya dancing. <laughs> Dude, I mean, this is... Oh my god. In hindsight, I definitely say this is probably one of the best videos uh, I've ever made, uh, just in terms of production quality, but also, like, I think that it is pretty funny, and I'm super happy with it, and it's, it's gonna be one of the videos I remember the most from this year, uh, from the channel. So, yeah. Moving on to number two, and speaking of original music videos, we can't forget about See You in Tokyo, uh, which is another music video, another original song uh, that I made and sh recorded in Tokyo uh, back in January of this year. It's showtime. <laughs> so we have Maya, we have Patrick, and we have Reds from Aura, super famous Japanese band. It's crazy that he's in this, like, doing this kind of thing. And of course, we have a little Mimulus plus Getrekt equals Heart at Heart Easter egg. I don't know, man. <laughs> See you in Tokyo. Well, now we're back again, back where it all began. Oh, we're gonna do the show like never before, live from Tokyo. Step right up, one and all. Coming at you like a burning cannonball. If you know the words, just let it go. I'll see you in Tokyo. Mata oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Mata oh yeah, oh yeah. See you in Tokyo. This video is so much fun. We had so much fun shooting this. Uh, it took like a full day and then it took like a week to edit it. I'm pretty happy with how the music turned out. Uh, I got this idea in the shower in my little apartment in Tokyo. Uh, just standing there and like, man, I want to make another song. I had already rented YouTube space later that week, uh, but I didn't have a song yet. <laughs> so I was talking to my and then I just had this idea in the shower. Like, let's just make it, let's just call it See You in Tokyo. And I just had this idea for the hook, like, Mata, oh yeah, oh yeah. And we were like, me and Maya were like, ah, that could be a song. And I made 
basically the entire song, a rough demo version of it, uh, in like three hours the night before we were gonna go shoot it. And then I brought the demo to the shooting and I had no idea what we were gonna do. And we had the classroom, we had the bar, and we just kind of made it, made it work. <laughs> and it's turned into this. So, you know, probably the most improvised video production I've done. Oh, I love that shot. Back <laughs> of him coming out of the closet. Did we buy the hats at Don Quixote? We bought the hats at Don Quixote. Don Quixote, by the way, it's like Japanese Walmart, pretty much. Next one we're gonna look at is, of course, this is Halloween remix cover featuring the odd ones out Oreo, Day by Dave, CG5, and Maya Fennec. This also one of my proudest achievements this year. I'm assuming most people on this channel have seen this, uh, but I reached out to all of these people to the odd ones out Oreo, Dave, CG5, Maya, and like, hey, do you want to do this? And they were all up for it, which was such an honor because I'm such a fan of these people, uh, especially like Oreo and CG5 as musicians. I look up to them so much, uh, and you know, that was out obviously. And then Dave and Maya are just so talented. Uh, I was super stoked to have everybody in it, and it turned out really fun. Here we have it. Almost out. And then Maya and Oreo. And then Dave. I love that shot. One of my favorites. Also, Maya animated. Well, Maya drew all these uh, drawings and then I animated them. Uh, but all the artwork is Maya's. So, you know, shout out to her. Man, I'm super happy with how this one turned out. Uh, yeah. Next one I want to look at is I'm Dead, I'm Dead Metal version. This was my 200,000 subscriber special that I released back in May. Uh, it's not very well produced. I did it kind of quick, but it was still super fun. Me and Maya actually went out to my old school where I went uh, in like first through third grade when I was like eight years old. And we went around that school and just shot the video. <laughs> There I am. Also, Maya had this shirt that said dead that she bought in Japan. It's way too small for me. But I was like, yeah, I'm gonna wear that. <laughs> so I wore that for the video. Brought one of my old guitars. Yeah. This is such a weird video. But, you know, we had so much fun shooting it and editing it. Uh, you know, it's not the best thing I've made, but we just, we, again, we had so much fun, so I just had to bring it on here. God, I look like shit. <laughs> yes, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh! I guess it's not really metal. I guess it's more pop punk kind of thing, but, you know, it's fun. Now I'm back at the beginning! Thank you. The next video is the one and only It's Okay Jaden Animations remix that I released a couple months ago, back in September, which was also the first time I remixed Jaden Animations. I'm just so happy with how this turned turn out, you know? What I really like about this one is the fact that it really sounds like she's singing for real, and you know, it could be, you know, a real Paramore kind of song. But I could be working But I could be working harder It's a good song, man! If you're allowed to say that about your own song It's okay, it's okay! That's a video. <laughs> I have fun making it. I, a lot of people seem to like it, so that's cool. So now the next video is, of course, my girlfriend reveal, which was my 300,000 subscriber special in which uh, we revealed to the world, me and Maya, that we had actually been dating or we'd been together for almost three years in absolute secret. Hey, uh, my name is Andigo. Welcome to my channel. And this was a very hard video for me to make. And as I explained in the video, you know, both of us work so much in Japan and there's such a stigma, such a taboo in Japan uh, when it comes to public people in TV or in the music industry uh, to having publicly known relationships. And we were like, oh, what if 
if we wreck our careers in Japan by announcing that we're together. We just kind of did it that way. And it's it's been working out. Everybody, like, there's been nothing but positive support. Uh, we were, like, super, like, preparing for people to, like, hate us. But uh, no, you people have been so very supportive. And that's been uh, not just a relief, but it's been feeling wonderful. So, you know, thank you. And if you do not know what Visual K is. Yeah, I just talk for minutes about like this whole Japanese girl, stigma. Here we are at 300,000 subscribers. Having reached this incredible, massive milestone, the mm. biggest one I've ever reached, obviously. Here we are. Um, I think I'm finally ready for the next chapter. Uh, <sighs> so emotional. With that, I think it's finally time to reveal right. the world's worst kept secret. The world's worst kept secret. And then we cut to the montage of all the pictures. Also, I can't, I can't play the music here because we got copyrighted, so I'll just add something else. Oh, man. Oh, I'm getting all emotional. <laughs> I can't watch this video, I'm getting emotional! I love Maya so much. <laughs> anyway, that's a video. Moving on! <laughs> the next one is this little thing called Bendy and Ink Machine Chapter 4 Song, I'm Still Here. This was the first time I attempted to do like an original song based on a video game in how long? Like in a year or more, two years maybe. Uh, I did quite a few of these back in the day, but I kind of stopped when remixes took over, but this was my comeback. It turned out pretty good, and a lot of people really liked it. Uh, and I'm super happy with this song. You know, it's inspired by the events of Chapter 4 of Bendy and the Ink Machine. And uh, I'm super happy with the mix and the video and everything. And again, we had Maya draw custom pictures that I animated. Um, but yeah, I'm super happy with the production, and people seem to really like this song. My first time kind of doing some kind of jazz uh, rockabilly kind of thing. Oh, looking so dapper, aren't I? Make you fall. Then I met you, sir, with your wretched smile. What a nightmare we went through. Land of love to hell on earth, and now, ow, I miss the drill. God, I'm so. I'm really happy with this one. I'm super happy. Um, I said this is, yeah, this is one of the best things I've made, probably on the channel, probably ever. So yeah. Though forever bound to this merry-go-round, but oh, I'm still here, yeah. I come the tide. So tell me, dear Joey, did you think you'd get away? Because this has always been my land, and you've got head to pay! I haven't warmed up today, I'm sorry. You've got head to pay! <laughs> this whole part was one take, improv. I hadn't written anything here, but I was like, I want to do a whale. So I just kind of did this. And it kind of works, I guess. I'm still here! Next one I want to look at is this one called Dan TDM called me 10 million subscribers. This was my April Fool's joke of this year. Uh, it was supposed to be like my 10 million subscribers special. Like, hey, I hit 10 million subscribers. And oh my god, Dan TDM is calling me in the middle of re recording the video to congratulate me for hitting 10 million subscribers. And then I unbox the diamond play button. It's all very obviously an April Fool's joke. But so many people in the comments didn't get it. And they were like, no, you're lying. He didn't actually call you. Why? You only have 300,000 subs. Did you lose 9 million? Look, a thousand dislikes. <laughs> but with that said, I'm still really happy with this video, the, the editing and everything. I think the joke came through pretty well. Uh, apparently, a lot of people didn't get the joke, oh so god, you know. Guys. Oh my god, oh my god, it finally <laughs> happened. Dude, this has been the craziest night of my entire life. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I woke up this morning, I went onto my social yeah. blade, and no, right, because social blade had a thing at April the 1st where you could like edit any number you wanted <laughs> just that day. Uh, this channel has hit 10. 10 million subscribers <laughs> overnight. And oh, here we go. Wait, hold on. Oh my god! Dude, look who's calling me! Dude, Dan TDM is calling me right now! <laughs> I renamed Maya in my phone to Dan TDM and changed her picture to Dan's picture. And I said, yo, Maya, could you call me? <laughs> Which she did. And she's still called Dan TDM in my phone. Oh, holy crap, I'm freaking out! <laughs> 
Uh, yellow? Oh, Endigo. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Oh my god, dude, I can't <laughs> believe you're actually calling me in the middle of a stream, even. Uh, dude, did you hear? I just hit 10 million subscribers on this channel overnight. Congratulations on surpassing 10 million subscribers. Oh my god, dude, thank you so much, man. <laughs> that was and so honestly, dumb. great job with all the, um, you know, charity stuff you've been doing. You've been killing it lately. Thank you, really appreciate it. Thanks for all the work you've done as well. With your songs and stuff, it's just insane. Dude, anytime, I'm, I'm just happy to help. Thank you for the support, that really means a lot. All right, dude. Thanks so much. I gotta get back to shoot. And then, of course, the 10 million diamond play button unboxing. Uh, anyway, I, I don't want to read this entire thing. It's very long, but thank you so much, YouTube, for this. Ladies and gentlemen, the diamond play button. Woo! So oh, dumb. Look at that. Look at that. It's so cool. It's right here in front of my face. Look at that. And the sheer amount of people in the so comments cool. who are so like, that's not how it looks. It's animated. You're a liar. Look I'm like, this. oh, this is insane. I'm like, oh, okay. Now we're down to the last two videos. And the first one I want to look at is a remix I made called Dead Memes. And this is a my so far only remix of iDubbbz TV. Uh, he uploaded some green screen clips and said, hey, make something fun with the green screen footage. And I did. I did a remix. And I think it's one of the best remixes I've made all year. Um, both the video, uh, I'm super happy with the edit and the music. Uh, and also iDubbbz commented, I think, on the video. Wow, that was crazy. I'm happy with it. Spirits, come to me. Spirits, Just the music. Give me your it's very pretty. If I may say I so myself. Like wow. So dank. Yeah, there we go. Boring. Boring. This is really boring. You really need to up the energy level. I'm getting sick of this. If you don't get on the ground right now, I'm gonna make a video about you. Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! And then... This guitar... It's pretty cool. I like those kind of U2 kind of things. U2 like in Seattle. Yeah, that's definitely dead. Oh, wait, by the way, I gotta, I gotta bring up another one. You remember Johnny Johnny Yes Papa? <laughs> I made a Johnny Johnny Yes Papa horror short film. It's 27 seconds long and React Channel reacted to it and MadPad watched it and he, yeah, he liked it. Uh, let's watch it right now. Johnny Johnny oh, fuck. Yes Papa. Eating sugar. I'm like getting creeped no, out myself. Papa. <laughs> nice. no, Papa. I like the changing hats. What is wrong with me? And now the real final video I want to bring up is this one, which is called Baby Cat, which is a The Odd Ones Out remix. I know I made a lot of them this year, uh, but I love working with James's voice. So James, he made a video talking about his cats and uh, I remixed him talking about his one cat called Baby Cat. Baby Cat. The baby cat, and now that's his name. Baby cat, baby cat, we all call him the baby cat. The baby cat, baby cat, baby cat, we all call him the baby cat. Now that's his name. Baby cat, baby cat, we all call him the baby cat. This is like a real children's show opening theme thing. They all live happy lives. My eyes get all watery. My nose gets all stuffy. So there we go. Those are basically the 10 videos I made. Well, 11, I guess, uh, this year that are some of my favorites. Uh, there are a lot more that I want to bring on here, but you know, I want to keep it in the top 10 list. Let me know which are your favorite videos uh, that I made this year. I'm uh, very interested to know. Let me know in the comments down below and look forward to a couple more videos coming before the year's over. There's got to be a proper look back at 2018, everything I've done and uh, yeah, stuff like that. But more on that later. But yeah, for now, I'm off to celebrate more Christmas every day meeting new pieces of the family so yeah thank you all for watching uh, if you had a good year leave a like on this video <laughs> if you have a bad year leave a dislike uh, leave a comment down below and tell me again wh what's your what your favorite videos of mine have been this year i'm very anxious to know and uh yeah peace <laughs>